Hey, my name is Marco from NeuroDesign Lab. NeuroDesign Lab is all about thinking different, new strategies and new approaches for all your business problems, business challenges. And uh, we use social experiments, which I love, which are pranks, psychological experiments. And today uh, we're gonna talk about, uh, we're not gonna talk, I'm gonna show you a movie about the social experiments about a meat-eating bag, a meat-eating handbag, which is uh, 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 an invention created by PETA, which is an organization um, to, uh, 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 to put efforts to prevent cruelty on animals, which I love, it's already a great cause. And now they create it in a big, big, big place, a big uh, 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 mall in Asia, uh, a shop, a leather shop, where they put up a leather handbag where there is an eating monster in. I don't know, I, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking we can learn a lot of how they set this up. It's a very professional setup. It's very ingenious how they uh, created the setting and how they interacted and filmed also the, uh, uh, the visitors. I would say let's uh, take a look at it. Um, let's go for it. Beautiful. Exotic glitter. Watch and learn because it's all about what you can learn afterwards in the video where I tell you certain tips to uh, perform in your own professional business. This is, this is professional work. It's in the jackets, it's everywhere. I would get a little bit pissed if I'm all covered with blood and stuff and it would certainly make me think there's a big message behind it and also the music I love how they set up the music amazing amazing how they did this Okay, um, it's an impressive uh, small video, short video, and I really like the message behind it. Uh, what did I uh, got out of it myself? Uh, it's a team up with brands. Uh, here in the video, they teamed up with an, an, uh, an advertising Bangkok uh, uh, organization. So PETA got approached by this advertising organization to participate with them. It's very smart because PETA has a big, big audience and is very good in setting a, a, a great intention there. Um, yeah, so, so I, would, I would suggest find a brand, a sustainable brand, uh, uh, an environment brand to hook up because that's also totally in uh, aspect of what is as now, nowadays. A lot of new generation are looking uh, uh, for companies, organizations who team up with uh, uh, valuable organizations 
uh, it could be WNF, uh, uh, it can be everything. Uh, but there is a catch. Uh, if you check, if you participate with an organization which is not something like this, and even this, they also got people who don't like PETA that much because they also compete with certain other organizations which are uh, abusing animals and want to keep on doing their job. So really do your research there in uh, uh, with who you participate and work together. Uh, and then focus on specific products. Here you see they focus on the leather. That's the only thing they do here. And then you see mostly the purse, uh, a belt, a jacket, uh, but it's all in the same section. It's all in the same category. And you of course can do totally the same if you offer thousand products and all the time have a different story people will be like what is the guy offering what is what is the lady offering to me so i would just find a product and find a product where you can innovate so you can renew extend the product uh, um, yeah that, that's very valuable to create more customers and next to that uh, create an impact uh, impact the audience impact an audience that is uh, uh, by in this case participating PETA making them participate and they have such a, a big audience themselves and uh, all uh, uh, their people were really shocked and really agreed to the message they were sending out so everybody was sharing this message sharing 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 which gave so much publicity uh, which really uh, 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 makes value of the whole setup of this marketing stunt because in the end this is a marketing stunt i love to look at social experiments uh, which makes me uh, see different perspectives other it gives me other ideas uh, new approaches for my business i hope you uh, like it also um, and every monday except today today is tuesday every monday i show a social experiment and I invite you to join me, to add me on Facebook, on LinkedIn. Uh, let's uh, connect together and see if we can create more and more new ideas and approaches. Uh, thank you for watching.